Hey there, vinyl community. So I started thinking about um, music, talking to some friends over the weekend, holiday weekend here in the States, I guess. Um, Easter weekend, if you celebrate. Um, and we were talking about music and, and uh, you know, what it meant and, and uh, how it could change the mood of things and, and music that, you know, represented like just you knew that the weekend was coming or you knew that a good time was going to be had when certain records came out. And, and um, back in those days, a long time ago, I used to go to a lot of college parties and, you know, records, uh, records weren't these collectors, uh, collector items. They were, they had music on them that we wanted to hear and we couldn't have cared less about the condition of the vinyl or the pressing or, or any of that stuff. And, you know, in a lot of ways, you know, um, we were freed from all that. You know, there was, we were looking for more responsibilities to take on the vinyl, the scratches or the, and, um, you know, records got played, they got taken off of the record player and put down and another record got stacked on top of them. And, you know, lost a lot of records that way, but, but we sure had a lot of fun, um, playing the music and, uh, and creating a lot of wild memories that um, are more important to me than than having those records would be. Um, some of them I still have, but um, one that survived from those years um, is this record, The Cramps. Bad music for bad people. Yeah, this was a record that got a lot of spins um, back in those years, and. Um, you knew that that the party was going to be good when the cramps got on the record player. And um, as soon as you heard those chords, and I remember this along with there was a soundtrack to a, a film, a, a zombie movie, um, not Night of the Living Dead, but you, you know the one, the one that has all the great, great music on it. Um, but the cramps... Um, they were, uh, this, this album has an interesting history as far as the um, band actually goes because um, the band never wanted this to come out. This is a compilation, um, although I never knew it was a compilation at the time. I always thought of this as The Cramps, their album, The Cramps album. Um, I, I didn't know that there was, you know, um, I knew there were other Cramps albums, but I always thought of this as like the first album or the, the best album. And um, part of that is because it's a, it's a compilation. They put on a bunch of, um, or, or a number of B-sides and, and things that at the time weren't available on any of the other records. IRS, who the, the band had left, put this out without the band's permission and, um, and subsequently made a, a, you know, the great cover and, uh, um, and, a, and a great, track selection too so you can't fault them for that although i'm sure that the cramps themselves were were none too happy about um about this there is a a more straightforward best of um british best of that you can get um but uh this to me has the magic of everything that i wanted to um to know about the cramps back then and I just wanted to share it with you. I shared it over the uh, weekend with some people and we laughed and had a pretty good time remembering a lot of those things that we did. And um, the music certainly brought me back to uh, a carefree time. And, and more importantly, I guess the message that I just had is um, um, you should, of course, treasure your records. And you want the, you know, some people want the best sounding one it's all cool, you know, that's nothing wrong with that. But don't forget that it's the music in these grooves. And don't be, uh, you know, don't let a um, little surface noise or a, a scratch or a click or a whatever uh, take away from the joy that the music brings you. That stuff never mattered back then. And the music meant more to me than, than ever at that time. 
and I didn't care if the, the record clip, clipped or skipped or, <laughs> or whatever. It, um, it was about all of us being together and, and having a good time. And, and that's what the music, you know, was all about. So anyway, just a little uh, reminder of that, and uh, I wanted to share that with y'all, and I and, uh, hope everyone's good and had a good weekend, and, um, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks.